Imagine standing in the middle of a rainstorm where the rain passes straight through your body without getting you wet. No sound, no impact, no trace. That's essentially what neutrinos do. Every second, trillions of them pass through your head, your phone, your walls, even the entire planet, as if nothing were there. Neutrinos are often called ghost particles because they almost never interact with normal matter. They slip through everything like whispers in a crowded room. Yet these ghosts are incredibly important. They're born in the most extreme places in the universe, exploding stars, nuclear reactors, black hole environments, and, most constantly, the core of our sun. How do you catch something that doesn't want to be caught? Trying to detect neutrinos on Earth is like trying to hear a pin drop during a rock concert. They went two kilometers beneath the surface, inside an active nickel mine near Sudbury, Canada. This is Snow Lab, and it's not a normal laboratory. It's more like a bunker designed to escape the universe. Above it lies a massive shield of rock that blocks almost all cosmic radiation, turning the chaos of the surface world into near silence. For decades, scientists believed that solar neutrinos should occasionally interact with a rare form of carbon called carbon-13. Not normal carbon, but a slightly heavier version that exists in small amounts in nature. If a neutrino hits carbon-13, it can transform it into nitrogen-13. That's nuclear alchemy, one atom quietly becoming another, triggered by a particle that barely exists. This reaction was predicted long ago, but never directly observed. The SNO plus detector finally caught it. When the neutrino strikes carbon-13, it creates a first flash of light. Then, about 10 minutes later, the newly formed nitrogen-13 decays and produces a second flash in almost the same spot. Scientists call this a delayed coincidence, but you can think of it like hearing a doorbell ring, and then, 10 minutes later, the same door gently closing. Over more than 230 days of observation, scientists detected exactly the number of events theory predicted. But enough to say, yes, this reaction is real. This matters because neutrinos are deeply tied to how stars work. They influence nuclear reactions, energy transport, and even the life cycles of stars. By understanding exactly how neutrinos interact with matter, scientists refine their models of the sun and other stars. If, by watching a giant tank of liquid in near total silence, scientists caught ghost particles from the sun, quietly rewriting atomic identities. No drama, no spectacle, just patience, precision, and a few flashes of light in the dark.